I'm Fiona Poole and I'm the award leader for the Duke of Edinburgh's International Award at Kalamunda Secondary Education Support Centre. Students are involved with a community service project uh, on the Kalamunda Railway Heritage Trail. This is part of their Bronze Duke of Edinburgh Award and also it's a wonderful opportunity for them to come out into nature, uh, which is basically on our doorstep here in Kalamunda. Mick and Kay have uh, set up an amazing project for them to be involved with. Uh, so far we've done a lot of rubbish collecting, which they all seem to really enjoy, and uh, raking honky nuts, learning about the bush and nature. Uh, today we've had really interesting uh, chat, learning about the Noongar culture and the season that we're up to. Uh, and yeah, it's just an amazing experience for them. My name is Kay Ammon and I'm the bush crowd officer. I've been doing it for about, oh, getting close to 10 years now. And I work for the friends groups to help them out whatever they want done in the bush. Education oh, support. the students there have been terrific for the last few years, having all the different kids. They're so enthusiastic and we really welcome, welcome them here. It's really good. Learning about the uh, Aboriginal seasons, just walking through the bush, checking out the plants and learning a little bit about them. And they're just learning about lots of things in the environment. There's so much to learn. It's called the two leaf tachya. It's called the um, bichada flower. As you can see, it's standing right there. Girosa. Girosa. Okay, we're just going to say. Native wisteria. What is it? Right there. <laughs> This one's a hairy jump flower. Look at all those donkey orchids in the one spot. Oh, right. Hi, uh, my name is Mick Davis. I work at the City of Kalamunda and I'm the Environmental Friends Group Officer. The Kalamunda Education Support students have been working along the Bilberman Track uh, and the Railway Heritage Trail this year, doing a lot of uh, educational work They've been learning about the importance of managing bushland for animal habitat. They've been looking at collecting all uh, rubbish and debris that they see. They've been working really, really well as a team and uh, learning in the outdoors, which has been really good. And you can see that they've been enjoying themselves. So the City of Kalamunda is keen to promote a lot of cultural awareness across all of our environmental groups. So that includes our community groups, our friends groups, and a lot of the schools that we work with. My name's Ethan and I like bushwalking because it's fun. My name is Stephanie and I like the sun and bushwalking. My name's Olivia and I like bushwalking because of the air and the flowers and the trees. <laughs> we learn about like the wildlife and how nature is like the nature is full of life and how it's special. Because we're helping the environment and the animals. Why do you think it's important to care for the environment? For the animals? I made a stick figure out of the sticks and the things I found. He's talking about some honky nuts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been yeah, collecting yeah. glass, wrappers, yeah. bottles, uh, so we can save the environment and so other animals won't attempt of eating it. I enjoy walking out in the bush. I do. Yeah. What do you like about it? Uh, just the walking part and the talking. The walking and the talking. Projects like this are so important because it gives kids, you know, of any uh, background, an opportunity to be engaged in the environment. They're learning when they don't even realise that they're learning. And, you know, you've got the fresh air, you've got the, the sunshine. So having young people making uh, leadership decisions, getting involved in managing bushland, understanding why and how to do it is really, really important. And we're really lucky here in Kalamunda because we've got a really nice matrix where we have urban areas where people live surrounded by bushland areas. So for the students' development and for their education, it's really important that they learn this stuff early uh, and they can carry it with them for the rest of their career and the rest of their lives.